August the 9th and August the 10th of 2020. This is for Capricorn Ascendant, Moon Rising and Venus Placement on their chart. Jupiter may resonate with the reading. Cross watchers are always welcome. So Capricorn, if you if I mention someone here and you know that it is not you, then it is not you. Okay, for those of you who is new to the channel, you might want to consider subscribing for I am always hosting a party online wherein I am doing a live streaming and on the live streaming you can ask me questions, okay? If in case that you didn't catch me on the live stream, there's a link in the description box. Click that link, you'll be routed to my page, tap in your question. But if you will participate in the live streaming, what I can suggest is for you to have patience. Um, I'm not answering questions in order. The reason being is because I am shuffling cards. I don't have extra arm to navigate the, uh, the, the chats. So whatever pops on the screen, that I will answer, okay? So Cap uh, Capricorn, if you also wanna know your lucky number and lucky color, follow me in Instagram. And caps if you do not have patience I'm not suggesting you that um, live streaming is the best for you okay but Capricorn if you resonate with the reading congratulations if you do not resonate with the reading come back to the reading after a week or two time is fluid if you resonate with some bits and pieces of the reading then still congratulations for i am doing a collective reading capricorn 300 likes for this video your next video will be a full reading like leo again four times in a row so if you have a leo placement might as well check leo's reading there's a lot of information it's a long video um there might be some bits and pieces that you're gonna pick up from them so might as well check but if you want your own full reading then 300 likes might as well click the like button now before you forget so let's begin capricorn okay this is your crown chakra but it's it came out in reverse so which means that something the universe is telling you to use your head but you're using it otherwise or you may have something here you have a poke in the universe that that is the thing that you should do but you didn't okay um i believe that you're going to receive here a communication um this might be a truthful communication but you're also going to doubt the person that they are not telling the truth okay again something always in reverse here it comes in reverse i don't do reversals but i think this is the time that i need to do it someone needs to hear this um, a communication here that you weren't going to believe but they really mean it okay I think you have trust issue um, yeah the, you're developing trust issue the person here would like to revive this connection that's true you might be connecting with a Scorpio or has a Scorpio placement on their chart or you have a Scorpio placement on your chart this is your wish fulfillment but although this is what you want, you're going to doubt the person. You see, as this person is sitting, it's kind of like, is that for real? Is that really what you want to say? But that they are, they really mean it. Okay, They really want to go back into your life here. They want a re revert, a re they want like a phoenix. They want to revive this. They want to give life to this. Probably you weren't going to believe their story. It's here there is always a doubt here but they do they really want to give it to you they really want to come back to your life and queen of pentacles they want to give you everything so this is the time we're in kind of like it's too good to be true and you won't gonna believe them but mind you okay just a reminder you've been praying for this but since you have you know you develop the trust issue like what i mentioned you weren't going to believe them this is the end cycle of this separation believe it or not six of pentacles the person will give you an equal give and take in this connection if they didn't 
um, commit before they left you, now they will. It's a promise, okay? What I want to know is this desk card here, okay? There's nothing much to, okay, because they gave you a burden. Well, that's, that's given um, if they got separated from you or you separated from them. Yes, that's given. Yes, this is a Scorpio card. You're probably stuck. You still remember the pain that they give you, right? That's why you don't want to believe them. That's true. So what I can suggest here is for you to cleanse, forgive yourself as well. Um, the world card. I want to see the world card. The magician. See? You've been praying for this. You're manifesting this at one point in time. But the universe is telling you this is your happiness. Believe them. You better believe them. Um, if, in case that you want them back to your life. If not, that's okay. Um, we're not forcing you to do so. But that's just a message from the universe. If you don't want them back, then you don't want them back. It's your life anyway. This is your reading, Capricorn. If you resonate with this and you want to go in depth, you can book a personal reading with me. Um, if you're okay with the reading and you just have a question or two, there's a link in the description box. Click that link. You'll be routed to my page. Type in your question. Click submit. So Capricorn, 300 likes for this video. Your next video will be a full reading like Leo. Click the subscribe button. Smash that notification bell. Comment down below. I'm very interactive. Thank you so much for watching. Love and light to you. Namaste. See you on the next reading. Goodbye. You want the best of my heart, you just gotta see the